Hey there folks, today I am bringing you what is probably the very last uh, usage-based tier update for Gen 5. Um, Gen 6 is really just around the corner and the Smogon community, as I recall, um, decided that this would kind of be just the end uh, of the usage-based tier updates. I mean, there are, there could still be suspect tests going on, but really it's time to just lock the tiers down and let the chips fall where they may. So, uh, drum roll, please. The, the changes to the tiers for July 2013, the very last changes are, that's it. Mandibuzz is falling to NU. No other changes to anything above NU. Uh, people are disappointed that like Metagross didn't fall down to UU. Sorry, it just wasn't going to happen. Uh, Mandibuzz is now NU, uh, used to be RU. Beyond that, no changes to any tiers uh, from OU down to NU. Of course, you know, PU will have tons of changes. Uh, PU is losing Basculin, uh, it's losing uh, Gigalith, it's losing Camerupt, and it's losing uh, Golbat. Uh, all these Pokemon are now NU. These, uh, the final, their final tier is NU. Meanwhile, PU is gaining back Zebstrika and Torterra, which were both uh, NU for the last three months. Munchlax, uh, How the Mighty Have Fallen. Munchlax was RU for the longest time, and it is now down to PU, where it will stay. Uh, Marowak has been going back and forth between NU and PU, and it's looking like it's going to stay in PU uh, for the end. And finally, we have Articuno, another Pokemon that's been bouncing back and forth a little bit, is going to end up in PU. So that's it. That's all the tier changes. Um, Smogon is currently down, so there are no threads on the Smogon forums. However, I will probably be posting this stuff to the Pokemon Showdown forum so you can look all of the data over. Um, I'm having to rerun some stuff, but nothing was going to change. You know, it's just one day's worth of data, and um, none of these Pokemon were close enough to the border to have that one day's data affect anything. So that's it, folks.